Hello, hello, it's your friend Doublebite, and we're here with Pokemon Blaze Black. So, this is a mod of Pokemon Black, and made by the Great Drano, um, and it's freaking incredible. It's the only Pokemon game I've played in a very long time, um, and I was working on a Pokemon Platinum uh, mod, so I'll probably be the next Pokemon game I play. Um, so this is Black 1. I've been playing Blaze Black 2 on my um, on the emulator on my phone. And just Pokemon Black and White 2 are not as good as the original as Pokemon Black and White. And the mod is good, but this one's way more brutal. So I'm going to be trying to Nuzlocke it. Um, so this is a modified Nuzlocke. For those of you who don't know, the idea of Nuzlocke is you have to catch the first Pokemon you encounter. And if a Pokemon dies, it faints in battle, it's dead forever. Um, which is, is brutal. So... I've honestly, I've played this game dozens of times. I have played through this game at least 10 times. And I've never truly Nuzlocked it. What I'll usually do is kind of a half ass Nuzlocke. But I'm gonna try it. Um, I have a backup plan where if I'm just too much of a scrub to Nuzlocke it and I give up, I'm going to do a variant, but gonna try to be as upfront with as possible there are some exceptions um if i get fully wiped i'm not going to kill all my pokemon start over um because fuck that i hate grinding i'll just level i'll just level up a bit more and then try again rather than like restart the whole game because i went into a battle under leveled um second i'm not going i'm counting pokemon that i've played used in my like current um like my current games as duplicates just because i want i'm playing pokemon i'm, pl I'm doing this for the variety so like if i'm playing entirely with pokemon that i've caught off video it's just gonna be more boring for me um i understand if you feel like that's kind of cheap or like oh well, how do we know you're not lying? Well, fuck it. <laughs> you don't. But, I mean, if you really want me to use a Kingler in two different runs, I can use a Kingler in two different runs. Um, Other things to know, I am going to be using Repels. Because I... Um... Actually, no, I'm not going to use Repels. Okay, I will use Repels to sometimes get from a light grass area to a dark grass area. But... um. What you call it? Train of thought. But like, I'm not gonna look up what the roots have. I usually do that, but let's let's go a little wilder. You know, I've played this game so many times, I'm already actually nose locking it, which I'm terrified about. But anyway, enough talk. Have at you. So I'm using the emulator um Des Desmumi. I heard it was the best one. It looks pretty good so far. Hi there, welcome to a new version of, of Innova, Blaze Black and Volt White. My name is Professor Juniper. Everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Nobody calls you that. Professor Oak is the Pokemon Professor. You're a Pokemon Professor. Thank you very much. Also, I have never played this game not using the speed up on the emulator, ever. I've always played this game at 3x speed, so this is torture right now. But this is what I do for you, for y'all, so you can have the beautiful Pokemon sounds and music and shit. This hack is inhabited by every Pokemon currently in existence. Isn't that fabulous? Yes, it is fabulous. That cape slash lab coat is fabulous as well. Mutations to Pokemon have also been seen. A great number of Pokemon have something different about them. Pokemon might have different types, abilities, stats, or movesets. It's practically an alternate universe. Differences don't end there. There's many things you may see. You might find stronger foes, different items, different evolutions. It makes for a fresh experience. Yes, it does. That is why this hack exists. That is why I play this hack. Repeatedly. Forever. Well, that's enough for me. Tell me about yourself. Are you a boy or a girl? Always play as a girl. Come on now. You know, you also know me better than this. Oh, uh, what's a good sassy name? Hmm, hmm, hmm. 
Uh, I don't know. It doesn't really matter that much. I'm gonna name my character Violet just because that's like my default name in every Pokemon game. And I was gonna try to get clever, but I couldn't think of anything fast enough, so fuck it. Also, I have to warn you, my Pokemon naming scheme is insane. You have been warned. My name is Violet, yes. Um, I was about to say something else. Oh, so my current game, I did um, Tepig as my starter, but Tepig's typing is actually different in this than the sequel. And I've used, I used um, Piplup in the previous game. Is it Piplup? No, 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 it's Oshawa. I used Oshawa in the previous game. And I've actually never used Snivy, so I probably should use Snivy. But honestly, I'll probably just roll a die for it. I think it's more fun. Two best friends, aka the two, the second and third best rivals in any Pokemon game. Gary Oak is the best rival in any Pokemon game. He is. This is objective. It's the one of the only good things about Red Blue. Don't don't question me on that. They're they're not as good as you remember. Anyway, this young man is Cheren. He can be a little difficult, but he's a very honest person. This young woman is Bianca. She's amazing and perfect and so pure. She's a little flighty, but she works very hard. Also accurate. I think you three have potential, so I'm going to give you... What are you going to give me? Money? A car? An apartment? A very, very important Pokemon. Also good. Violet! I'm right here, you don't need to show up. The moment you choose the Pokemon that will accompany you on your journey, your story will truly begin. During your journey, you'll meet many Pokemon and people with different personalities and points of view. I really hope you can find what is important to you in all of these travels. That's right, befriend new people and Pokemon and grow as a person. That is the most important goal for your journey. And also saving the world, that's gonna happen too. Let's go visit the new world of Pokemon! Okay. Cool, I got spring. Game Freak presents. I'm not gonna read all the text. I might read all the text of uh, fuck it. Pokemon Black version. More like Blaze Black version, 420 Blaze it. It is actually 550. I should have started this at 420. That was a rookie mistake on my part. Violet! Why is everyone shouting in my fucking ear? I heard from Professor Juniper, we can have a Pokemon? No shit. They're in the giant box right there. Let's keep him Bianca. I probably should do voices for them. Am I a little late again? Uh, sorry! Bianca. I've known for ten years that you have no sense of time. But seriously. Today's the day we can get a Pokemon from Professor Juniper. I know. Sorry, Violet. Sorry, Charon. So, where are the Pokemon? In the box. Why are you also not noticing this big, beautifully decorated box? They were delivered to Violet's house, so Violet gets first pick. Naturally. The Pokemon are waiting for us inside that gift box. Okay, Violet. You go first and take a peek at the gift box. I want to meet the Pokemon right now. Weep. Violet opened the gift box. Whoosh, turbo graphics. Thanks, Drano. He has a good egg. I, I know him on Twitter sometimes. Choose a Pokemon. Okay, so I'm gonna. I have a D12 on my desk, aka the most useless of all Dungeons and Dragons dice. So we're gonna roll for it. Um, one, two, three, four is gonna be Snivy. 5, 6, 7, 8 is going to be Tepig. 9, 10, 11, 12 is going to be Oshawa. Thank God I got I know my numbers correctly. Survey says... It rolled off my table. Take 2. We got 1. So we are going to do Snivy for the first time ever. There's a very good reason I never pick Snivy. But we'll get to that. I do like Snivy. I like Snivy as a design. I mean, picking the grass starter is a bold move. And the second gym in this is um, a bug gym. So that's not ideal. There's also a flying gym. And an ice gym. So that's also not ideal. 
Um, yeah, the gems in this are a little rough for the grass type. But that's okay. Okay, I'll take this Pokemon. Charon, that one's yours. Hey, how come you get to pick out my Pokemon? Oh, never mind. I wanted Tepig from the start anyway, because I'm that guy. Everyone has chosen a Pokemon, so that's that. Hey, I know. Let's have a Pokemon battle. Honestly, Bianca, even though they're still weak Pokemon, you shouldn't have Pokemon battles inside a house. Oh, don't be a worry war. These little ones are weak, like you said. I have to let them battle so they'll get stronger. It's settled. Violet! I'm right here! Get ready for a Pokemon battle. Wee 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 wee. Okay. God, the animations are so slow compared to like what I'm used to. Oh god, this is gonna take me so long. All right. Oh, this is brutal. At least during my grinding, I can speed it up. Good ol' Audinos. I would keep track of how many Audinos I killed during this game, but it's gonna be in the hundreds. Oh, you piece of shit. Really? Am I gonna faint on the first battle? Fuck, I just fainted on the first battle. That is an entirely new level of bullshit. No, I'm not restarting just because I fainted on the first battle. My punishment is that I don't get that experience from having the first battle. So my life is going to be slightly worse now. That's just fucking peachy. Anyway, I've been ignoring this dialogue because I'm cranky. Whoa, what happened? Wow, Pokemon are amazing. So little, but so strong. I'm so glad I get to have a Pokemon. What about my fucking room? Thank you. Oh, um, sorry about your room, Violet. You are completely hopeless. Now watch as I make the same mistake as you. Here, I'll restore your Pokemon for you. Violet's Pokemon needs to be fixed up too. Yeah, I'll fucking say it does. Fucking crits. I could turn off crits in Pokemon, I would. They're the worst part of this goddamn game. Hey, Charon, how about you ruin the room again? Well, you know, I'm sure you can battle without turning the room into a disaster area like I did. Fuckers, hate you. I believe you're right. There'll be no problem for me to keep the room from getting any messier. Where did the footprints get on the walls? Besides, it's not fair if you two are the only ones who get to have fun battling. It's decided. You'll be my opponent in our first Pokemon battle. Let's see what you can do, Tepig. I am challenged by Pokemon Trainer Cherub. Tepig. What am I going to do? All right. Let's try this again. We're going to do Leer, then Spam Tackle. Spamming Tackle is arguably better. Um, I find that usually the, the starting Leer makes it a little bit more... You've got to be kidding me! Game! Game, what is this shit? Game. Game, that's some garbage. That is some garbage right there, game. You owe me. You owe me big time. This feeling. Finally, I'm a trainer. Top of that, we better go apologize to your mother about this room. Apologize to me, you asshole. It's not my mom's room. I guess it is my mom's room. She owns the house. Whatever. Oh, I better come too. 
Later, assholes. Be that way. Okay, I don't even have the running boots yet. I'm very sorry about all the trouble, ma'am. Well, um, we can clean up. Cleaning up. No worries, I'll take care of it later. Shouldn't you be on your way to meet Professor Juniper? Yes, thank you. Please excuse us. Come on, let's go thank Professor Juniper. I'll be waiting in front of the Pokemon Research Lab. Oh, wait! I've got to go home first. Thanks for having us over! Peace out, motherfuckers! My, my, Violet. Pokemon battles are so lively, aren't they? You can hear the Pokemon's cries clear down here. Hmm, that sure reminded me of my first Pokemon battle. Oh, you know, after a battle, you need to rest your Pokemon. I should make that my uh, text message ringtone. Your Pokemon is looking great. Shouldn't that be our looking great? Oh no, because I only have one Pokemon. Wow, I'm stupid. Now, if you're going out, don't forget your bicycle and phone. Oh, they give you the bike right away. Damn. Bold move. Tap in the bicycle. Bicycle in the key items case. I can make the text scroll faster. Holy fuck, I'm stupid. I usually just smash the button. You're going to thank the professor too, right? Better get going, honey. Okay. But more importantly... Wait, what's my start button? I thought that was start and select. Game, what's my select... Emulator, what's my select button? Hey. Hey, you. Yeah, select is right, shift start is enter. Start button, let me assign my bike. What? What was that? Apparently S brings me to this menu. Neat. I learn something new every day. Cool. And then... Ba -ba -ba -ba. Oh, yeah. Herbs. The right shift doesn't actually seem to be select. What the fuck? Alright, hold on. Oh, I'm dumb. It's X and Y, not... Shift select whatever. Oh yeah, I got the I can zoom now. We Alright. What up, home slice? Alright, I gotta go to Bianca's house. Wow, everyone's a dick to Bianca. She is so precious and pure, and y'alls don't appreciate her enough. Speaking of don't appreciate her enough. No, no. A thousand times no. But I'm I'm a good trainer who got a Pokemon and everything. I can totally go on an adventure. Oh, it's okay. It's fine. I'll be waiting for you in front of the lab, okay? What a dick. I'm gonna talk to him. Douche. <laughs> That's a secret. Okay, okay. Okay, let's go meet the professor to get our Pokemon. Oh, wait. Can't believe I lost both of the starting battles. That's just fucking embarrassing. God damn. Oh, uh, I'm done. Wow, Charon, would it be a dick? Juniper, creatures, Pokemon, existence, why? Unusual Pokemon battle, that's why. Trust me. Nickname? Hee hee hee, this is my favorite part of all of Pokemon. Naming them. You may think, why is my favorite part of all of Pokemon naming them? Because. I'm not sick. 
but I'm not well. Welcome to hell, neurotic people. <laughs> yes, I am okay with this nickname. <laughs> it is a great name. Why did you give us Pokemon? Pokedex? Pokedex? Astonished extensively. Beginning. Pokedex. Encounter. Pokemon. Unova. Quest. Names. Adventure. Pokedex. Yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you. Trainer. Thanks. Possible. Ding. Good talk. I will happily go to Route 1. Wee. Peace, motherfuckers. Oh god, more. Wait, wait, this is when I get the running shoes. Okay, that's important. This isn't a good cutscene. There you are, Professor. Pokedex? Believe. Yes. Ask. Maps? Team. Map. Map. Items. Sharon. Care. Bianca. Thank you. Violet. Worry. Violet? Pokemon. Destroy. Bedroom. Pokemon side safe. Parents. Pokemon. Nova. Wonderful. Trip. I don't get the running shoes yet? Map. Helpful. One? Let's go. Hold the fucking phone. I definitely get the running shoes like really early on in this game. You there. Running shoes. Break. Break. Pokemon. I know I played this game like 50 times, so I was convinced I got the running shoes there. I mean, it's less important since I had the bicycle, but they are easier to control than the bicycle. Violet, it's this way. Bianca says if we're starting a journey together, she wants us all to take our first step at the same time. Well, that's cute. Hey, Violet, let's all take our first step on Route 1 together. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, motherfuckers, that was several steps. Can't count. Oh, I wonder what will happen. Isn't this so exciting? Yeah, it is. It sure is. Come on, the professor's waiting. We like little cherry blossoms and shit. Or leafy things, petals. Mr. Juniper, I'm sorry to have kept you waiting. Now that everyone's here, I'll explain. Pokedex's pages update automatically whenever you meet a Pokemon. Moreover, set up information catch. Demonstrate catch, Pokemon. Battle. Pat rat. Gino. Minchino, right? Or is it Minchino? I think it's Minchino. Mincino? I mean, yeah. I actually don't know. Gotta be Minchino. Alright, catch the motherfucker already. Pokemon! So one of the cool things about this mod is that almost every route has, um, like every route has a more or less unique set of Pokemon, and even the ones that do have some overlap, they, um, it's like there's like eight to ten possible Pokemon every single route of the game. So. I think this first thing has literally all of the basic cast normal types starting out and all of the basic cast flying types starting out, like just in this first route. So you could catch like 10 different Pokemon. Oh, I'm just gonna scooch my blanket. It's cold. It's not cold, it's warm, but like I turned off the AC because I got cold and now I'm warm. It's all confusing. Anyway, got Pokeballs. But yes, you could theoretically go to the first gym with like 10 Pokemon, but we're not gonna. I'm gonna have a decent number of Pokemon before the first gym. This is, this, Black White is pretty generous about that. Tall Grass, Cumulatown. Dropping. Wait a minute. Fun. 
Get going. Listen, catch most Pokemon. Not gonna be me. Juniper. Interesting. Dex pages. Town. Deal at your own damn house. Oshawa. Alright, let's catch a fucking Pokemon. Ooh, it's gonna be a uh, Zigzag Zoon. I actually quite like Zigzag Zoon as an early Pokemon because of the pickup ability. Um, so you can get some early items. That's fun. But it's level 6. So we may die to a Zigzag Zoon. Because it's higher level than our Pokemon. The amount that I hate everything right now is high. Please don't die to a Zigzag Zoon. Please don't crit. Okay. I ain't running from this shit. Come on, motherfucker. Oh wait, we're playing Pokemon. I gotta tap A repeatedly to make it work better. There we go, see? Never fails. You learn that shit in like elementary school. Everyone knows that that works. Science fact. Alright, I caught myself a zigzag zoom. It was very cute. Let me think. Always gotta think of a good name for your Pokemon. Most important part of the game. Can't wait for me to misspell a Pokemon name in my name. That's gonna be just stupidly embarrassing. Okay. Get off the bicycle. We're gonna not encounter another. Mmm. Uh. No. -ho. I hate you so much, game. Like, if I was- if I... Thank you. Like, if I was going truly hardcore on this, I would have had to restart the game three times by now. That's insane. This is just the saddest thing. I can't believe I'm recording this. This is- this is just fucking pathetic. Okay, so if I recall, when we go to Accumula Town, there's a battle waiting for us. So I am going to grind a little bit here before that. And we're at the 27 minute mark, so I think this is a good place to end this episode here. So, this is a bad start to, to this run. Like, Jesus Christ, I, I don't... I, I literally have fought in three battles and fainted i've literally tried four battles and fainted my starter in three of them so that's just sad but uh the show must go on or some shit so i saved the game also gonna save state up the default save state buttons were shift and f1 to save and just f1 to load that is guaranteed to fuck you up like, that's a terrible system, so I just, like, switched it. That'll be fine. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this tragic beginning, and fingers crossed for next time. But until then, double bite out.